If you're new to Jacksonville, you may not know about one of its hidden gems, and I do mean hidden. Heck, you could be from Jacksonville, driving right by, have no idea it's here. Bold City Brewery, a family owned and operated business tucked deep in the heart of Riverside, Bold City is a must see on the Jacksonville Ale Trail. Now, when I say family business, I do mean the whole family. The owners are Brian and Susan Miller, a dynamic mother-son duo with a passion for beer. They get a lot of support from the rest of the Miller crew who help them out with the marketing, the distribution, inventory, and of course, the brewing and bottling. My name is Brian Miller. Uh, my official title is, is Director of Brewery Operations, uh, but I'm also the co-owner. Bold City got started in October of 2008. Uh, that was our official opening day. The Bold City name uh, for us comes from uh, really the love of our city. Um, my mom and I uh, were both born and raised here, and we kind of felt like we were starting at a point uh, during the recession, uh, and that was really a bold move for us, uh, and we were getting into a uh, business that we knew nothing about. We never actually had a business of our own, first of all, and then to get into kind of a complicated uh, business of brewing beer and selling beer and all that, uh, we felt like it was a bold move for us. And so uh, I sent my mother an email. Uh, I had been home brewing for about four years before that. I uh, sent her an email and I said, hey, we should start a brewery. And she was getting ready to retire, I didn't want anything of it. Uh, and so we just kind of continued the conversation. Um, and then within about six months, we had a brewery. question I think is, with so many uh, microbreweries popping up everywhere, what is it that makes Bold City stand out? Well, I think the original thing that makes us stand out is we were the actual first microbrewery in Jacksonville. Um, you know, it, a lot of people get confused. I had a guy come in last week who said, well, I went down to such and such place and they said they were the first, but they were actually a brew pub not a microbrewery, we were the, the first microbrewery in Jacksonville, which is pretty cool. And um, it was cool for me because I traveled a lot and seen a lot of microbreweries around the country. And when Brian decided that he wanted to do this, I thought it was a pretty cool thing. Um, and obviously it's caught on pretty well. You know, it's, Florida alone is just grown when, when it comes to microbreweries, so. And I didn't know this, I thought this was uh, something to seriously brag about, is that y'all were the first craft beer in Disney, is that right? Yep. Yeah, we're the first microbrewery in the Food and Wine Festival at Epcot. Wow, that uh, seems like our, a perfect fit. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Um, and last I checked, um, Bull City Brews rated the number three brewery in Florida, wow. which is a pretty big accomplishment. Yeah. Um, and this is, you know, we're going into our eighth year. We have our uh, anniversary in October every year. And um, I mean, to accomplish, to achieve so much in such a short time is from a business standpoint, it's pretty pretty amazing. Yeah, I should say so. You've got such a nice place here. It's a very chill vibe. I like it. It's very relaxed. And you get a real sense of how the beer is made. You obviously offer tours, yeah? Oh, for sure. On uh, We do tours every Saturday uh, from 2 till 5. So, you know, for anyone that's coming to Jacksonville to visit, I would hope that they would get a chance to stop by, come in and get our experience here, come in and be part of the family. In a very relaxed atmosphere here. It doesn't matter where you're from, you can be family here. Um, and you know, we have the tours, come in, take a tour, take some beer home with you, share with your friends, wherever you're from, and then, you know, just enjoy yourself. Will, thank you so much, man. Not really a problem. Pre really appreciate your time. Thank you very much. One thing I can say about the city of Jacksonville is that they've supported us from the very beginning. And I'm sure every brewery maybe says they have the best customers in the world, but I, I truly think that here in the city of Jacksonville, we have the best customers in the world. Uh, we are like a big family here at the brewery. Our family owned and operated. Uh, we've always wanted to have the culture that whenever anybody comes in, no matter who they are, we treat them like family. We have visitors come in uh, all the time from all over the world. It's always cool to hear their stories and just kind of see the excitement when they get to come in and see the brewery. Jacksonville's reputation as the burgeoning hub for craft beer is legit, and we have spots like Bold City Brewery to thank for it. Make sure you stop by while you're in town and tell them Wander sent you. What's wrong with this picture? <laughs>